Hello there, Megan here. In today's Learn to Monetize More video series, we're going to teach you how to forecast an ad exchange line item in DFP. The objective of this tutorial is to leverage DFP's power to help you make forecasts or predictive outputs that you'll require in expecting future inventory for a specified period of time. Over the span of our videos covering DFP, we've taught you how to create orders, add units, and line items that help you manage ad inventory. This time around, we are going to show you how to draw forecasts from DFP's historical data to predict future inventory. This is especially useful so that you don't overcommit yourself to advertisers when selling ad inventory. Are you ready? Let's begin. Let's first log into our DFP account and navigate to the Delivery tab. The most common reason for checking available inventory is to ensure that there's enough inventory available when creating a line item that requires a specific quantity of impressions. The second most common reason is to confirm that a saved line item is slated to reach its goal. If the line item cannot meet its impression goal, the forecast feature in DFP can help the ad optimizer determine what changes need to be made in the settings and targeting sections in order to meet the goal. Now let's check our available inventory. Since we're already at the Delivery tab, let's now click Check Inventory. We now need to enter Start Time and End Time. We'll simply pick a 30-day period. After that, you'll see Quantity. Select Max Available if you don't have a specific impression or click goal in mind for the prospective line item. If you have a specific impression goal, select Goal from the drop-down and enter the number of impressions or clicks you want. For our purposes, we'll choose Max Available. Now, scroll down to the Add Targeting section. An optional step is to apply targeting criteria to your forecast. For our purposes, we'll go to Geography and select United States. Once done, scroll down to the end of the page and click Check Inventory. We can now see how many impressions DFP anticipates will be available to us for the selected time period. If you want to save this forecast report in your computer, just click Export Forecast to export the details to a spreadsheet. Lastly, we'll click View Contending Line Items to check the effect of booking the prospective line item on currently booked line items, and vice versa. We hope you enjoyed our video today. Stay tuned for more updates by subscribing to our blog and YouTube channel. Bye, and we hope to see you again soon.